Hello, I want to show you guys how I actually make my salt. This one I have right here at my in my bag right there. Uh, this kind of salt also drops in the red areas, but uh, they have made an update and it's not that often it kind of drops. So uh, you see these kind of salts right here are the ones that are dropping more often. But uh, the main problem is that you need a lot of great materials for doing it. But I'm going to do it because you asked me. Uh, these are the ingredients right here. And you actually need to be high level to do it. Um, so you have to make all the other things and craft a lot of things before you actually get high level. So, uh, but it's in the bottom right here. And why I'm making this one is because it actually make the most of the of the damage and it's 60 damage right here as you can see and this one uh, make a little more but uh, I want to do this one for you so that's how you do it and now I have a new one beside all the other things so I'm actually incapable of showing you guys where the other uh, question you asked me about was where to get these loops right here the raider uh, crowbars that you have to use to actually um, take down the other players and you have to know also this particular sort is in a drop uh, sorry in the loot also in this base area right here now I don't have enough crowbars to actually go to that area so wouldn't uh, recommend doing it when you don't have more than five otherwise you actually can get them in these drops right here you can see them they're right here uh, they're rare items so that's why you maybe go have to go back and forth more than five times and like I said I always travel uh, from uh, the abandoned mine to the silo because that's the lowest distance and there is also a drop inside of this area silo uh, now they have made an update once again that there's a, a timeline that going to about I think it's three hours or something like that and that actually make it uh, more difficult to get the drops uh, from going from the band mine to the silo and back and forth so you can also get drops you can see all the things that actually drops inside of the, uh, the different areas by tapping them Let's just hold down the area then I can see what kind of drops they have and all of them actually have the, the, the rate of crowbar and that's a good thing because you need that to get into the to the layer of the other players so uh, but these three areas up here you also get them inside of the bunkers but uh, the bunkers they are uh, more rare items so um, they're in the bottom right here but I definitely recommend that you try out going these loops right here and trying to get them. Um, yeah, so, but I will go to this bunker right now and you'll see a video about that soon. So, bye.